All right, welcome to my next fitness video. Last time we did sit up basketball where we're shooting. This time we're gonna play sit up catching. So there's two ways you can play. I'm gonna play with a tennis ball. And if you have a wall to throw against, you can rebound it off the wall and catch. If you don't have a wall or don't have a ball that bounces, you can throw it up in the air and then catch. You could do this one hand to other hand. You could do it just with one hand behind your back to make it harder. So you can do it in different ways to make it harder or easier or just a little bit different for the game. So I'm going to show you two ways to play. All right, here we go. So the first way is we're sitting down here and we do one sit up, up, and we throw and catch and then back down again. As many as we can do in 30 seconds. Or I'm going to show you a different one in one second. Right. Our other way of playing is we're going to throw it against the wall and catch. So I go down in my sit up position, up, throw and catch as many as I can do in 30 seconds. All right, let's give these a go. All right, so we're going to do it our first way of sit up and catch. I'm going to try and throw the ball above my head. All right, 30 seconds on the clock. Your time starts now. So up, throw, catch, one. Try to do it with one hand, left hand to right hand, left hand to left hand, so you can change it to the place. Shearer is loving the ball. Time's up. All right, we'll give it a go against the wall as well. You can have a go at either time, doesn't matter. Okay. Time is ready, 30 seconds. As many catches as they can do. Again, further back makes it harder, closer makes it easier. You can have your feet against the wall too to help you with some momentum. So it's up to you how you want to play. Ready, three, two, one, go. One. Two, go to left hand to right hand. Three, four, try one hand. Five, six, switch hands. Seven, eight, and you can catch it any way you want. You can do it with two hands. Nine, 10, 11. You can do this with a basketball as well. And practice your chest pass. So it'd be a bit harder. Shira's gonna help. Oh, time's up. All right. All right, so that was our game of sit-ups and catch. So you can throw the ball in the air, or it doesn't have to be a ball, any object that you can catch, or you can rebound it off a wall and catch. You could do this with a basketball as well. If you wanted it to be really tricky, you could change the ball and use like an oval-shaped ball, like a football, to make it harder. Um, as well. So you can change the game based on maybe a different sport that you play and it can be integrated into your training. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.